Today I'll be exploring the Ubarek. This wreck is one of the largest ones in Grand Traverse Bay that has been discovered. This particular wreck lies roughly 400 yards off Sealer Park Boat Launch in Acme, Michigan, at a heading of around 285 degrees or so. I'm also going to mention that the official coordinates published on the Michigan Underwater Preserve site are very likely off by about 50 yards or so. I say this because the satellite imagery clearly shows the actual location of the wreck. Finally, I'd also like to mention that Taylor Park does have a restroom for anyone who needs it. The wood that sticks straight up that you're currently seeing is the most visible portion of the wreck. It is also the closest portion of the wreck to the shore, which makes the wreck a little easier to find. I'm also going to mention that the wreck was unofficially marked by an old laundry soap container last year. However, this marker was not put on this year for some reason that I am not aware of. I'm about to show you a list of some of the possible names just to show you how many there are. As you can see, there are at least eight possible names. The only well-established fact is that it is a schooner from the 19th century. I also wanted to mention that this wreck seems to be associated with the year 1894. This wreck also has relatively few muscles on it compared to other wrecks in the area. I'm not quite sure why this is the case, but I suspect it has to do with the shallow depth, which is only 15 to 20 feet or so.
wreck has a lot of fish near it. This is the reason why it is one of my favorite wrecks in this area. I'm also going to mention that we are not using wetsuits for this dive either since I don't personally find the water to be too cold in August. However, many people would probably want to use a wetsuit for this dive. Hope you like my video of this dive. This is probably my favorite wreck in Grand Traverse Bay and I hope you will like it too if you choose to dive on it.